leather jackets, sandals, even Valentinos. If it's broken, this studio in East Vancouver wants to fix it. We've seen thousands of items every month. and We're keeping all those items out of a landfill. Metro Vancouver residents throw out an average eight kilos of clothes every year. That's the weight of about 44 t-shirts. And Return at Depot stopped accepting textiles earlier this year. I think that you can buy new shoes every six months to a year, um, but when you choose to repair it, you're, you're making a choice that these are my boots and I want to keep wearing them. Over in Richmond, Renewt specializes in repairing outdoor gear. I was also part of a waste management project in my previous company. We talked to a lot of local waste management team uh, for waterproof fabric. They all saying waterproof fabric is like plastic, so there's no better way to recycle them it's, instead of it's only going to incineration. He repairs the kind of clothes you see a lot on the West Coast, down jackets, waterproof pants, and also ski gear. I think the best way, if this cannot be, the material cannot be fully recycled, the best way is to makes the user life longer. That's the reason why I started this company. Buying new clothes comes with more than one kind of cost. Up to 8% of the world's greenhouse gas emissions are from the textile industry, according to the UN. There's just no way we can keep going the way we are in terms of the amount of waste that we're creating as a society. This Vancouver consultant wants to make it easier for retailers to offer repairs to their customers by selling them something he calls a renewal service. Talking about repair maintenance, um, alterations, and then refurbishment for resale. It allows the retailer to offer these services, but without taking on the load of the complex operations. Making it easy and streamlining convenient is so, so crucial. But even as these businesses want to help mend your clothes, it's a skill they also encourage learning. We're really excited to see people that do repair their own things. The repair isn't just something that other people do, it's something that you can do yourself if you're looking for a new career or even just a fun new hobby at home. It keeps, you know, things out of landfill, it keeps stuff going. Um, it's important, it's kind of the future. A future where the clothes we wear have a little more history. Jonna Bailon, CBC News, Vancouver.